New at six, a six-year-old girl punished, denied lunch at school because she was home sick for more than a week. The charter school in Brighton saying the long absence disqualified this little girl from the free lunch and reduced lunch program. 7 News reporter Lance Hernandez trying to get some answers for this girl's mom. Lance? And Michelle Hernandez was very upset when the director of this school booted her daughter out of the free and reduced lunch program. Turns out he wasn't authorized to do that, but his actions are raising questions about how many other parents have received similar letters and how many children have gone without meals. It was appalling to me. Michelle Hernandez very upset about a conversation she had with Kimberly Vega, manager of Brighton Leadership Academy. Vega wanting Hernandez to come talk about her daughter's extra long absence. Hernandez saying she had no transportation to get to the school. Next thing she knows, her daughter comes home with this letter saying she'd been terminated from the free and reduced lunch program. Your reaction when you saw that letter? I said, oh no, I gotta do something about this. She calls 7 News. Brighton Leadership Academy is part of the Hope Online Learning Academy co-op. Amanda Colina, the co-op spokeswoman, says our students are never denied lunch. I emailed her a picture of the letter booting the six-year-old out of the program. Colina telling me that letter was not authorized. Do you think other students have been denied lunch? Yes, I do. I asked how many other unauthorized letters have been sent out and how many children have missed meals. Colina says Hope Online Academy is investigating. Hernandez says many of the students here have parents who are immigrants. And if they get a letter like that, they're not going to go shake the boat. They're not going to do anything. So they just are stuck with finding other ways to feed their children. Now, Hope Online Learning Academy offers a universal free lunch program to 3,000 students across Colorado. The spokeswoman telling me that this school among them are all part of the national school lunch program. In Brighton, Lance Hernandez, 7 News.